And now the Donana County District Attorney wants to clarify an issue. We're talking about accusations of dropping cases, dismissing them, and then not alerting victims. The DA says those dismissals come after a new rule was passed by the New Mexico Supreme Court. And it's not like anything what happened here in El Paso under the former DA, Ivan Rosales. Instead, it has to do more with the new case management rule, which just passed back in June, that was designed to eliminate the backlog of cases and provide a much more streamlined process for moving those cases through the court system. DA Byers explaining that the courts have the ultimate authority on how the cases are actually managed and handled. But as far as those controversial reports about these dismissals, the DA says it is on a case by case basis. The Supreme Court's rule was to limit the amount of time that a person spends incarcerated in custody, their liberty removed from them prior to trial. The concept is that the person should not be punished before they are found guilty of the offense. Now here's another part of the issue. The case management rule also requires the criminal arraignments within 15 days of a grand jury indictment or only seven days if that person is still in custody. And with the high number of people indicted, arraignments are taking much longer, which is partially to blame, he says, for that backlog.